<laughs> that sounds good. Yeah, and you put it on like crackers and the... Or toast. Your Ooh. toast is what made me think of it. Oh. Hey, you make toast now? Well... No, I don't. it's it's kind of hard to make the toast on the hibachi. <laughs> you get those nice little lines on it, though. Yeah, that's what, yeah. I make it, the grilled cheese on the hibachi. Do you? Put the rock on it, psh, and you just smash it right down. Oh, the rock the helps, huh? And the Velveeta runs right out. See, I like the Velveeta. You are everything. all about the Velveeta. The Velveeta runs out, drops down into on little coals, psh, and it smells like burning cheese, <laughs> which is my favorite uh, scent in the whole world. Mm, okay. Well, now, did you just bring one recipe today, or did you I brought, bring... I brought a little, a little dessert type of deal. I can found it. That's uh, a cute little notebook you have. Thank you. And this one was uh, given me to by my mama. Your mama? Uh-huh. You take, uh, it's called a grape salad. Gr a, a what salad? Grape salad. Gr grape? Grape. You uh, know oh, the, grape. You know, the... What grape. did you think I said? <laughs> <laughs> well, I wasn't quite sure, Chef, no, no, Chef it's, Sorta. It's my, my, no, it's my, my language is not, I'm still learning. <laughs> you take a, an eight ounce package of cream cheese and it's set out on the counter till it gets soft. Okay. You have a counter? Well, no, but you do. <laughs> then you take about eight ounces of the sour cream, take a cup of brown sugar, a big bunch of the grapes, the seedless kind, cut them in half, a teaspoon of vanilla, and a cup of your chopped walnuts or pecans. Just put all that into a bowl and stir it up and eat it. Oh, wow. It's really good. That sounds easy, too. Mm, it's fattening, but it's good. It's really good to eat. Well, you're not very fat, though. No, I stay on the bicycle all the time. Oh, well, that probably does help a lot. Can you do that again? <laughs> I do it all day. I do it in my sleep. I woke up the other night. I thought somebody was a running for me. It was me. Legs just to going. But I got the powerful legs and the strong feet. Oh, it was, you know, the, the lake I, my am staying at. It's a long ways from here. Where is it? Do you know? They call it the Hebron. Oh, that is a long way. Hebron? Is that what the Hebron? Yeah, something like that. Hebron? Hebron. <laughs> Hey, burn. Hey, burn. What you gonna do with that pretty woman? <laughs> oh, you're quite the singer. Now, you know there's singers coming in after you today. Did you know that? No, ma'am. We have the great Kelly and Cano coming in. Yeah, have you ever heard of them? Kelly and Cano. The Kellys. Is he... Uh, Kelly, is it the girls? It's boys. The boys. Boys. Is the Kelly related to the Mr. Kelly that they have uh, come out here? It is the Mr. Kelly. I didn't know he could sing. Well, he can. <laughs> yeah. He I'm, says he can. What does he do? He plays gu 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 guitar. He plays the what? The gu gu guitar. <laughs> I think your language is rubbing off on yes, me, Chef Sorta. I rub off on the people. It, it comes off in the washing machine. Uh, sometimes you get in trouble for that, don't you? I do. I do. <laughs> yes, Kelly and Cano. Now, Bruce Cano is the other guy. Have you ever heard of him? Uh, no, I don't think so. Strange name. It is, and it's spelled strange, too. It's K-N-O-C-H. And you say how? Cano. Okay. Cano. Maybe somebody needs to talk to him how to spell. <laughs> I think it looks like not. Cannot. K N O C of H. Uh huh. Yeah, that would be na 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 no, I don't want to sing. You don't sing? No, I don't, I don't sing very much. Well, you know, when I'm by myself in the shower, when I have a shower, I sing. <laughs> Did you notice that Cushing has a, a new motel going in over by the... I went by there the other night. I was going to stay in one of the rooms <laughs> to keep the doors locked. Oh. And there's nothing in there. I don't want to lock them. <laughs> How do you know there's nothing in there? Were you peeking in the windows, too? I was. Oh, Chef Sorda. I did his skies on like I was a, a construction guy. Ride up on the bicycle, and the guy said, Hey, you're late. <laughs> <laughs> I said, I know, sir, I'm sorry. <laughs> Try 
doing my best to American accent it didn't work. No. Told me to get lost. Now I think last time you were on we talked a little bit about where you're from and I don't even know that you know where you're from, do you? It's kind of dicey. <laughs> I don't, uh, I think I'm somewhere from around, uh, Bar uh, Bar uh, no, that's not it. <laughs> somewhere between the Spain and the Napoli. Oh. Now, have you been into Roma's? The new Italian restaurant in here. No, but I've been by in the back and smelled things of cooking. No. Oh. Smells good to me. Have you thought about trying to get a job at a place like that? A what? A job. You know, where you actually I, work and they pay you for it? Well, they probably have a chef. They do. And you know where he's from? No. Italy. His family's from Rome. Some of my family's from Italy. The Roma family. The Roma family. Mm-hmm. Sounds like a singing group. It does. That is a gentleman. Meet the Roma family. Tonight the Bobby and the Sissy are going to dance and the Roma family is going to sing for you. <laughs> Did you ever watch uh, Lawrence Welk? Because you sort of remind me of Lawrence Welk as far as your voice goes. Yes, uh, that was about the only thing uh, that my parents would allow the TV to be on was the Lawrence Welk. Because I think they connected with him. Yeah. They, they did a lot of polka. Oh, okay. And, uh, so, you have any Polish in you? I don't think so. You like Polish sausage at least? Oh. Do you have any recipes for that? Yes. Take it out of the package. Stick it in the pan, <laughs> heat it up, and eat it like crazy. <laughs> or, for the appetizer, uh -huh. you make a little slices, put it in the oven, put drip a little cheese on it. Well, Velveeta, no doubt. No, not really. Oh, no, regular I like, cheese? I, I like it, the mozzarella. Oh, that's your other favorite cheese. It's pretty good. Pretty good. And then you stick those little toothpicks in them? The what? The you know, Toothpicks. Toothpicks? Uh-huh, those little pieces of wood that are small and you pick your teeth with them. Are you not familiar with those? Pick your teeth? Why would you do that? <laughs> well, you know, when you get that little something hanging in your, between your teeth, like a little spinach. Uh, I just go, tss, 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 when I do that. <laughs> it sucks it right out of there. <laughs> oh, and, and your hair. You know, if you went to work at Roma's, they'd probably make you put your hair in a in one of those nets. A Have net? You? Yeah. Oh, net. Okay. Hair net. That'd be okay. That'd be Not okay. a fishing net. That'd be okay. I'd do that. do that. Have you ever had a job? Well, of course. My grandfather had the restaurant. Too. Where was that? <laughs> I don't know. Spokane, Washington. <laughs> Spokane? Mm -hmm. And I had the, rhythm, the, the little restaurant in there. And I was the short order cook. You were short then? We, well, yes, I did the short orders. <laughs> oh. We were only open for breakfast. Okay. We were a packed all the time. So what... Adam and Eve on a raft to wreck them. What? What? Who on a raft? Adam and Eve on the raft and the wreck them. Uh, what does that that's mean? A, that's the two uh, eggs over easy on the piece of toast. Oh. So that's the raft. Rack or raft? Raft. To right. Adam and Eve on the raft. To you know, sometimes, sometimes you're hard to understand. <laughs> That's what my mama always said. <laughs> what the police said the other day, too. You're a little hard to understand. <laughs> no, what he said was your strength.